What's up everybody, Paul Hickey here with your Data Driven Daily Tip. Today I'm gonna to show you how to do some pretty cool tricks in WordPress. Uh, specifically, I'm gonna show you how to do a really amazing hover state that has an animated GIF when you hover over it that uh, you can use to create a WooCommerce product grid. Currently this does not exist in any kind of plugin available. There is a plugin, however, called the WooCommerce Product Flipper. Uh, many of you have maybe seen this video on YouTube. I'm gonna link to it when I post this video. The Product Flipper plugin, um, basically what it does is it gives you the ability to have a uh, hover, hover over the image and show a different product when you use the default WooCommerce product grid. So for those of you e-commerce website content managers and developers and marketers out there, you can do something like this, which you can see on my screen right now, when you hover over the WooCommerce product, when you're using a product grid, it changes the image. But the reason why this wouldn't work for me is because um, what I wanna do is something like this, where when you hover over it, there's an animated GIF that shows, and it's really cool because this is like a tube uh, of a skincare product that gets folded down and raised back up. So assuming that you uh, can create the GIF on your own, I'm gonna show you the ability to hover, how to set it up in your WordPress website to create either just a regular hover state that's cool uh, and unique or uh, use it as a WooCommerce product grid. So here's the step-by-step -step process. Uh, first, you're obviously gonna create your alternate image, your hover state, which in this case would be an animated GIF. You're gonna upload it into the WordPress media library. Um, once your images are up, uploaded into the WordPress media library, I'm going to now show you the custom code that I used. It's just custom HTML code that can be um, entered into a code block. So you can see here I'm using the Enfold theme. I've got my color section. I've got text blocks, uh, buttons, and I've basically recreated what is a WooCommerce product grid uh, that's different than the actual WooCommerce product grid that you would get uh, out of the box in a theme. So basically um, you're designing your uh, uh, product headline, your price, and uh, in, in your code block is where you're basically going to have this code that I'm going to copy and paste into my uh, blog post when I post this on dataoveropinions.com. And all you're doing here is you're saying this image right here in the media gallery, this is the URL to the image in the media gallery that's going to show up when I hover. And this image right here is gonna be the image in the media gallery that shows up when I uh, am not hovered on it. And so then from there, um, you basically have this amazing hover state. And for those of you who don't know how to upload uh, and find the URL of an image in the media gallery. I'm gonna show you that as a bonus in this data-driven daily tip. So you're gonna go into media, and in this case, I'm gonna go ahead and just find the media that I used as the GIF. Uh, so here's the media that I used as the GIF, and when you click on the media to get the URL, you can actually go over to URL on the right-hand side, double-click, right-click, copy, Boom, paste it into your code and you're done, my friends. This has been your data-driven daily tip. WordPress developers, designers, con even content managers. You don't have to be a developer or designer, just a content manager, marketer. You want to do something cool with your e-commerce product grid with WooCommerce or you want to do uh, something just cool with your hover states on your website with an animated GIF. This is how to do it, my friends. Uh, for more free digital marketing tips, go to dataoveropinions.com. To up your digital marketing game, check out datadrivenacademy.org. And did you know that now you don't even need to log into Google Analytics? You can just ask Alexa how your web traffic is doing. For more information on this, go to askdatadrivendesign.com to request your free trial of our brand new Alexa skill, Ask Data Driven Design. Um, please subscribe on the YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Paul Hickey. Please subscribe and listen to the podcast at datadrivenpodcast.com or the Alexa Flash Briefing available 
at datadrivendaily.com. And just to do business with us, just to have a business development conversation with me, hit me up at paul at datadriven.design. I would love to hear from you. Hopefully this has been helpful. Thanks and have a great day.